New this morning, a hit and run crash in Washington Township. It happened near an apartment complex on Governor Square Road, just off of Miami, Miamisburg Centerville Road in Washington Township. And please tell us the guy who hit a woman's car likely had too much to drink. Now, luckily, they did catch up to him and he's now being questioned. Our Amber Watson talked with the, with the woman whose car is totaled and is now figuring out how she'll now be getting around without it. Amber? Right now, police are questioning a man possibly involved in this hit and run crash. And they found him a few blocks from here on Mill Wheel. And the crash happened right here behind me. You can see the tow trucks are here and they are towing away this car right now. Now, the sergeant I spoke to this morning tells us that the driver was heading west on Governor Square. Then that driver smashed into a parked car and took off. And when deputies got here on the scene, that driver was nowhere to be found. Now, this morning, we spoke to the owner of the car that was hit, and she tells us that she was sleeping and woke up to the bright lights. So I um, pulled up my blinds, and there was just a car sitting in the middle of the road, and I just still thought the motor was dumped. And then I came out after I seen all the fire trucks and everything, um, and the neighbors were saying how my car got hit. <laughs> I'm kind of numb. I just, <laughs> I just got to do what I got to do. Now that mother we spoke to tells us that she works in home care and uses her car a lot. So, you know, she's definitely frustrated with the accident this morning. Now, when deputies got to this crash site this morning, they did search this neighborhood, and that's when they found that man near a dead end, again, on Mill Wheel. And he was taken into custody. He is being questioned right now by officers. And the sergeant tells us that, you know, the man that they did find did have the odor of alcohol on his breath. But the sergeant tells us that they've had a communication barrier because that man that they found does not speak English and did not have any IDs on him. Now the sergeant tells us that the car that person was driving was licensed to a landscaping business here in Washington Township. And right now the sergeant is not saying the name of that landscaping business. Coming up though in the next half hour you'll hear more from neighbors and how they describe this road. For now reporting live in Washington Township, Amber Watson, ABC 22 News.